It is very popular recently to label yourself as either an introvert or an extrovert. In popular culture, these words are usually paired with if you're an introvert, you're shy, if you're an extrovert, you're outgoing. But in psychology, these terms are defined as this. And this is from the myersbrig.org website. Extroverts get energy from active involvement in events and having different activities. They're energized by other people and excited when other people are around. Introverts get energy from dealing with ideas, pictures, memories, they often prefer doing things alone or with one or two people that they trust. However, usually in our world, when you're out and about, having an introverted personality can mean that people see you as standoffish or unsociable. And therefore, out of the two traits, being introverted is the less desirable. Now, I love being an introvert, and I know many of you introverts out there feel the same, but because the common conception is to be extroverted or outgoing, sometimes I have to turn on my outgoingness. The outgoing introvert has to be talkative and active. They have to make an impression with people so that they don't seem shy. And let me tell you, this is hard. Introverts should not have to do this, but we have to keep up with people. We have to keep up with the extroverts out there. During Playlist Live, I was exhausted by the end of the weekend. I went to dinner on the last night and I just, I couldn't talk to the people I was with. I was really trying and overreaching because I just, I had no energy to be with people or to be sociable. But there are positives to being the outgoing extrovert. If you can easily turn on that outgoingness or the extroversion, then you can be super adaptable. You can really blend in or be in any kind of situation. But I can never really tell when I'm going to use up all my outgoing energy. So I may be having a good time, being very sociable, and all of a sudden my mood totally switches. And all of a sudden I cannot deal with the people I'm around. I need to go and be alone and re-energize myself. And I never know when that's going to happen. So some people think that I'm super moody because I'll be yay, fun, fun, and then I'm like, I hate you all. I want to be alone. Are you an outgoing introvert? Which personality side do you side with? Are you an introvert or an extrovert? I love to know these things about people. I really think that Myers-Briggs and the personality types are super cool and I love reading into them and I always want to know what someone else's is so that I can like look up their profile and try to match to see if they they fall in line with what their profile says. If you have any questions about Myersburg profile types or anything like that, please let me know in the comments. Thank you all for watching. Please click subscribed if you're not already subscribed, and thank you for watching.